Hey, welcome back to the channel. Hope you're doing well. Hopefully you're having a great day. And yeah, if you're new here, welcome. Hopefully you get something out of the video and you enjoy the video and you stick around and watch more and maybe subscribe. So let me show you how to create this artwork. Okay, so in Blender, this artwork has, has been done before um, by James Trellis. I think that's how you say it. But um, yeah, his video is a bit longer than what I plan to make this one. So let's see if we can do it quicker. Okay, so what I'm going to do first is go Shift A, add a plane. And this is just so we can basically see what we're doing, and like where we're working, and we, it'll help. So next thing, Shift A again, mesh, add a UV sphere. Now what you want to do is go here, G, and just bring it a bit forward. Okay, now scale it up. Something like that. And then go into your camera. Go here. And then go here. Just bring the camera up. Just something like that. Now, scale this up some more. Maybe bring a little bit forward. Okay. Now let's get it down. Let's bring the camera up a little bit. We're just playing a tango with it. Okay. Looks good. Now shade smooth. And then tablet subdivide. And it's subdivided again. Cool. Now, let's go here. And just drag this up just slightly. Perfect. Okay. Let us now put the grass on. So, if you've got polygonic, you can use that. If you've got grass, another kind of grass, add-on or you've got cross particles you can use that anything so scale this up just make it a little bit smaller just scale it up a little bit more perfect now let's add a hdri so i'm going to use HDR from Polyhaven, but you can use any kind of daylight. Now, light um, HDR. Okay, so I'll use this one here from Polyhaven, the sunflower one. So let me find it. This one here. Just drag it. And then I'm going to just go to the 8K version. And let's have a look. And that looks good. Now what we can do is just add some here. So what we can do, let's just close this and make it a little bit less. have a look a little bit more perfect now let's just scale this up very nice let's go to the camera just bring it in a touch looks good now let's add something here. So what you can do is just shift the camera and then all we do is just go here and go to models. And rotate it. 
Let's drop this down. You can use any model you want, obviously, but let's get it up. Let's have a look. Okay, what you can do is make this a bit wider. So I'm going here. And then just mess around with the something like that. And there we go. That's the scene. So you can obviously mess around with it and make the chair bigger if you want. But then if you render it, let me render it quickly. So let's go here. Yeah. 300 and then. And you can see, that's what the final image looks like. So hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, smash the like button and I'll see you next one.